please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey Raptors, welcome back to the JMMS Raptor News. Today is Monday, December 12th. On to the weekly news. Lunch with Talia, Aubrey, and Anna. Monday, December 12th. Yestada beef stuffed sandwich, baby carrot, salsa cup, orange, and milk. Ethan. <laughs> McDonald's or Wendy's? McDonald's. Why? Because their service is always better. Okay. Tuesday, December 13th, mesquite chicken drumstick, cornbread muffin, vegetarian baked beans, mashed potatoes and gravy, apple and milk. Wednesday, December 14th, cheeseburger, potato wedges, dragon punch, juice, milk, applesauce. Where are we here with? Line and Anthony Sellers the third. Russell and Werner, Westbrook. Okay. What food do we eat for Christmas? Uh, I like gobbling down that turkey because uh, I love me some meat. Um, gingerbread. Yeah, yeah. Thursday, December 15th, corn chip pie, wango mango juice, craisins, and milk. December 16th, nacho pretzel pocket, salsa cup, cherry star juice, cherry applesauce, and milk. Hector Whites. Okay, and what is your favorite Christmas drink? Hot chocolate. Thank you, Raptors. Vocab Word of the Week by Noah and Giancarlo. This week's vocab word is modify. The definition of modify is make partial or minor changes to something typically so as to improve or make it less extreme. Example. This guy's gonna modify his truck with a better engine. Um, the definition for modify for me would actually be like adding attachments or making it maybe a different. But the way I would use it in a sentence would be like, I would like to modify my account. Where in the world is Ramon by Emma? Three facts about where Ramon is. It's from Queensbury, New York. It's approximately 85 to 90 years old, and it's an 82 foot tall Norway spruce tree. Um, maybe the Golden Gate Bridge. Oh, <laughs> New York. Ohio. Thanks, Raptors. Admin updates by Aubrey and Taylor. Hi, James and Rose students. This is Nurse Atkins here um, with some reminders. Um, just remember that you do need a pass to come to the health office from class, so make sure you get that. Um, it's just safety reasons so we know where you are in the building. Also, too, um, make sure you come in if you're feeling sick. Make sure you come in here to get checked before you call your parents because we need to know if there's something that's going around that we need to be more aware of, so make sure you're doing that. And remember, always um, cover your mouth when you're coughing blow your nose, and uh, wash your hands. Thank you. Make sure to have a pass when you come down to the nurse. Make sure to cover your mouth when you're sick. Hi, Raptors. Getting bullied? Where do you go? Go to your teacher, and if nothing changes, go to the counseling office. You guys have any questions? Um, no? Yes, Emma. Yes. A student is bothering you. What do I do? I can move the seats if you want me to. That'd be perfect. Thank cool. you. Uh -huh. Ugh. Man, this is ridiculous. Miss Teacher Lady? Yes. This student keeps bothering me. Can I see the counselor? Sure.
being bullied, you can fill out one of these forms in the counselor's office. They can be filled out anonymously, and the counselors will call you out of class the best available time. They can help you. Who do you go to for help? If you need help with supplies, you can go to your grade level counselor. If you need help with your computer, you can go to room B208. If you need to know what the dress code is, you can ask any staff members. And if you need to know what your specific class supplies are for school, then you can go to your Google Classroom or ask your teacher. You need help with your Chromebook? Come to room B208, the technology office. Hey Chad, I have a question for what you. Up, um, do you think this shirt's good for dress code? It looks nice, but I don't think it's really dress code because I think you're supposed to be wearing a polo. Oh, cool, cool. Have a great day, Raptors.